Hey, what's going on, everyone? My name is Aaron. Wow, that guy's a little bitch. Anyway, welcome back to another episode of Forza Horizons 2 Fast and Furious. So, um, yeah. How are you guys doing? And I just got done making a GTA 5 video on Xbox 360. And in that, yeah, in that video, I was just rambling on how, like... Yeah, how Microsoft fucked me over again. Oh, let me, let me just turn this down a little bit. There we go. But yeah, Xbox fucked me over again. Microsoft fucked me over again. Um, if you guys want to see it, just check out that GTA 5 video. It's my latest GTA 5 video. If you want to check that out, then yeah, check it out. Okay, so as you guys may have known if you watched my other video then um yeah I have an Xbox one found it in the hall but anyway so okay this game this game that I'm playing right now is free I got it free it's a Forza Horizon 2 expansion and it was free it was free of charge on Xbox 360 and Xbox one how do I know it was on an Xbox One free? How how I, how do I know it was free on Xbox One? Was one of my favorite YouTubers, Fierce the Amazing, was playing this on Xbox One, and he said that he got it free. And he's not a YouTuber that pirates. Like I'm a YouTuber that pirates. Uh, he he doesn't pirate. He's completely legit. Trust me, guys. This was on the Xbox One. This was free. And I, I got my Xbox One. I was like, oh, I'm going to play this. And this going to be so... Ne oh, no. Damn it. No. Did not mean to do that. I pressed Y by accident. And I was like... I was like, oh, I'm going to get some really, really nice next-gen graphics. I'm going to download this and get some really nice, cool next-gen graphics and get some achievements. Nope. Microsoft took a shit on my face. And they're like, nope, you're paying $9.99 for this. Plus tax. So, that is $11.64. No, that is $11.29 right there. You want me to pay $11.29 for a game that I got free on Xbox 360 that I was supposed to be able to get free on Xbox One, but I can't. So, what the hell? What the fuck happened? Seriously. Why do I have to pay? Why did they just change their mind? And be like, oh, this game is getting a lot of sales. We should, we should, like, did did you really just did they just do? Why can't they just have a free game? Seriously, I mean, why they can't they just keep this game free? That's just really stupid. I I don't know why they didn't just keep this game free. I mean, this game is great, but you know what? I think it would be told I think it would be worth buying it. But I think it would even be more worth it. Now no, I got it free, I think it was even more worth it. Cause you don't have to pay shit for this. I didn't have to pay shit for this. And I love I've loved this. And I'm really disappointed that Microsoft is like is just took just took a shit on my face and like, no, pay for it if you want to play it with next gen graphics. I don't give a crap what you think. That, that that really that's really mean. That's that sucks really badly. And um yeah. Yeah. So but oh yeah, and also from that other video, I already completed this game by the way. I forgot to show. What? Let me go. Let me just quickly go back to my garage. Wait. No. No. I'm rewinding that. I thought crashing into that fucking car. Merge. No. Wait. Shit. Fucked up. Fucked up. Okay. Let's try to stay in the in the, this lane. Is that car? There it is. It's just on the other lane. Oh god. Damn. Just slow down a little bit. Alright. ABS kicked in. 
All right, let's just cruise. For, let's just cruise a little bit right here. Yeah, this game is really awesome. I don't know why Microsoft is making making us pay for it now. It's it's really sad. And what's really cool? I wish I had Xbox Live Gold right now, because then I would be able to play online GTA Online, and plus I would be able to get Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag, and I would be able to get um. Um, what's it called? Army of Two Devils Cartel. That game, I, I played the Devils Cartel demo. It's so cool. I really want to play it. But I can't. Because I don't have Xbox Live Gold. It sucks. It really sucks. So unless I get, like, one of my friends that have Xbox Live Gold to log on to my PS3, I want to be able to play I mean, yeah, did I say PS3? Wow, I'm an idiot. Did, did, did you hear what I said? Every bit of what I said is fucked up. Unless I get my friend, one of my friends has Xbox Live Gold to log on to my PS3. That sounds fu- that was- that was- I- I sound- that was sounded really stupid. Xbox Live Gold, PS3. That- those don't go together. Oh my god, I feel like such an idiot. Um, my neck hurts. It's kind of a long story. I don't really want to talk about it, but let's just say this guy named Alex is a fucking asshole. And if there was a day that I could do anything, I'd go into a police station, get a gun, and shoot him in the fucking face. Yeah, I'm just gonna say that. And also, yeah, and let me, let's talk about my class for a second. All right, I know you guys. Some of you guys don't really give a shit, but you know what? I'm gonna tell you. Cause guess what? I don't give a shit if you give a shit. <laughs> oh, I need someone to talk to. This is the only one. That, you guys, you guys are really good listeners. That's why I love talk. That's why I love making videos. Like just to like get shit off my chest. So like, <clears throat> wait, what was I? What was I saying? Oh yeah. Um. Okay. So. I. Okay. So yeah. Um. Okay, after I got the McLaren, I got the Bugatti Veyron. And after I got the Bugatti Veyron, I got, um, wait, where is it? Where is it? I got the Dodge Challenge, the 2015 Dodge Challenger. And see this car? This car I actually saw it in, I actually saw this car in real life. It is badass. I'm being, I am dead serious right now. And I also saw this 2015 Dodge Charger too. And it looks really badass. It, like in my opinion, I like the 2012 one a little bit better. Like I like the 2012 like, Dodge Charger Super B. Yeah, but but yeah. Oh yeah. As a, okay, now I remember what I was saying. So the reason why okay, there's this kid, there's this guy and my um okay, you want let's take out a uh, car should we take should we take out? Let's not take out a supercar. Let's take a what's the twenty fifteen Dodge Charger. Dodge Challenger. There we go. Let's take this baby out. Alright, so I'm gonna tell you guys why okay, the, there's some students in my class who are fucking pieces of shit. Alright? I am being dead serious. Okay, so me, I'm as you guys know, I I am I have an auto course at my school, and I I take that auto course, and um, so I wasn't really I don't really pay that much attention in that course, like in like to what everybody's doing, like they always they're always like, oh, I'm fooling around and shit. And so on my evaluation, I was like, they were like, you should stop fooling around less. Like my group members were like, you should stop fooling around less and start doing more work. So okay, so I I start so today I started I do I did that. I was following what I what what they said, and I was I was paying attention. I was kind of bored, but I was paying attention. 
And so then, Mr. Hay, my te my um, my auto teacher, he said, he asked he asked the class like we want somebody to put the um the the um brake drum and the wheel back on the pedophile van. Yeah, the pedophile van is. <laughs> <laughs> the pedophile van, like we have, um, yeah, it's a, it's a Chevrolet Chevy van. It's a Chevy van. <laughs> oh my God! Good job, Chevrolet. That's the best name for a van. Let's call it. What should we call it? What should we call our van? What? I don't know. Let's just call it the Chevy van. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, it was a Chevy van. I'll just, what, I'll just call it. A, let's just call it a pedophile van for now, okay? Because it does look like it's a it's a pedophile van. It looks like a pedophile van, okay? Anyway, it doesn't matter. So, so it was jacked up, and somebody was working on the drum brakes that are on it. So I went. Uh, no, nobody went over. Nobody was going over. To, um, thing with the pedophile van, so I decided to go over. I put on the brake drum. I put on the brake drum, and it took me like it was really hard to get on. Like it was really heavy. It was really heavy, and it was rusted, and it barely fit in uh, back on the back on the um on the brake. And, like it barely it barely fit back on. It took me. Like, when I finally got it in on, like, it wouldn't go in properly, so I had to, like, bang it in, kick it in. Then, I had to get the wheel on. Let's do some drifting. Then I had, then I had to get the wheel on, and the wheel was too heavy. The wheel was really, really heavy. Like, I am, I am most, I'm a pretty strong guy. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm actually really, really strong. I'm stronger than I look. Like I may be five foot four. Five, no, five, I'm, wait, wait, what am I talking about? I'm five foot five. Five. Foot, my mom's five foot four. But anyway, I'm five foot four. I'm pretty strong. And I tried to lift that tire. I can lift the tire, but it's he it's heavy, and I have to put on a fucking axle. And. And so I tried to lift it. I couldn't lift it. It was hurting my it was hurting my hand. It was hurting my fingers. I was afraid that I would break my fingers because it's really heavy. It's the full it's the full rusted old tire. Like it's not like one of those new modern tires. It's a fucking old ass tire with a rim. Like mean, with with the rim, the old ass heavy stainless like like steel rim. And it's it's really he it's really heavy, so I asked my group one of my group members I asked my group members to help me with the wheel, and they said no. They just stood there by freaking Alex's Lexus, just staring at it. They weren't even doing anything. They weren't doing anything to help to help with the Lexus, but I asked them to help me with the thing because they weren't doing shit. I asked them to help me. They told me to, they told me to do more better. They told me to pay more attention in class, all right? And I did that. And I asked them to help me. Simple fucking thing. I asked them to help me and they just ignored me. So then you know what? I was like I tried to do it myself again. And I was like, "Fuck this. I'm going to ask Mr. Hay." So I asked Mr. Hay to help me and then he tells he tells them he tells my group members to help to help me. To help me with the tire, because he sees that they're not doing anything. I, I was like, "Can you can you help me with the tire?" Because I'm a I asked them and they're not helping me. They just ignored me. And he 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 told them to help me. They didn't do shit. Still, like they just fucking stood there. They want me to do fucking better, and I'm trying. To, I'm asking for help, and they won't even help me. Like what the fuck? And they're asking for like 80s and 90s. Like, how the, 
Why would why, why do they deserve a nine eighties and nineties if they can't even help their own teammates? They're being freaking hypocrites, being like, "Oh, you should do more better." How can I do more better if I don't know what I? I'm trying. I'm trying my best. I can't lift the fucking tire. I'm asking you for help, and you won't help me. How is that? The fucking idiots. The fucking pieces of shit. I don't like them. That's why when I. And don't even get me started on this other girl, Janelle. Oh my god, she's such a bitch. I mean... Okay, just imagine... Okay, just imagine you're working on a car. You're under the hood. The, um, you know the thing that holds up the hood? The, um, are the, the arm that holds up the hood. Alright? So, it's bent. Imagine that's bent. And you're like, I, I hope it doesn't fall on me. I hope it doesn't break and fall on me. And then Janelle, the freaking retarded bitch ass self, she's like, I hope it does. Then I won't have to, then I won't have to hear your annoying voice anymore. I won't have to see you anymore. You know how fucking terrible that sounds? Huh? You know how terrible that is? Why don't you guys tell me in the comments? Tell me in the comments. If you what 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 would you guys do? Does that? Cause she's a she's a complete bitch. She's she always seems to be quiet. I mean I am I, I'm people yeah I'm weird. I'm weird at school. I'm weird all the time. I'm weird in my videos. Everybody knows that. I'm weird, and I know that I'm weird, and I'm not gonna change for shit. But they're just like they're just like. Despising me. It's like, like they're treating me like I fucking raped their sister or something. They're treating me like if they, f I fucking killed their, killed their parents and I just got out of jail. I mean, just imagine how you would treat, how you would treat. Okay, just imagine you invite somebody into your house and they freaking take, and they freaking take. A, a frying pan and hit it on your mom's head and she gets knocked out and she has to go to the hospital and she has a concussion then you the next time you see that person they get out 10 years later they get out of jail you see that person what are you gonna feel Th that's what they're that's what they're looking at me like they look at me they look at me like I fucking killed some but killed one of their family members or like I did something bad to them I've never done anything bad to them I'm very, very quiet. Like, I'm not very quiet. Like, I'm not that... I make jokes. I make jokes. I'm a joking... I'm a funny guy. I like to make jokes. I don't just sit there... Like, if I hear something that sounds funny, I'm gonna say, like, that's what she said or something. Like, I'm not just gonna, like... Like, that's just me. That's just me. You guys, like, people don't understand that. They will just judge you and judge you. Like, sometimes they don't say anything, but they're just like... It, it hurts. It really does. Like, just imagine some... Just imagine, like... The pres... Just imagine, like, you have a... There's this person that you really admire. Yeah, you guys, you guys should probably already know what it's like. So, like, she's a complete bitch. Honestly... I could do some. I should do something. Seriously, I wanted to fucking punch her in the face. I am dead serious. But yeah, you got. You want? You guys, tell me in the comments. Tell me if you guys experienced anything like that. Because you want, we should stand as one and go up against this fucking bullshit. Because just because we're different, that does not mean, that does not give people the right to, like, just be a fucking complete bitch. I mean, there was a, I, today I saw, I saw this, um, girl in the bank, and she was walking like, like, she was like, she's walking like if her, half of her body's paralyzed. Or something. Like, just imagine that that... Okay, go watch Family Guy. Go watch that episode where 
Peter, like, the left side of Peter's body get, is paralyzed. Woo, that drift. Go watch that episode. That's literally how she was walking. She was walking, like, I, I don't know. She, like, it was really weird. I felt bad. I literally felt bad. I mean, I walked perfectly, and she's just walking like that. It makes me feel sad. I mean, when I see somebody with a, with a disability, it just makes me feel, like, sad. I don't know why, but it does. But yeah. I, I, didn't, I didn't laugh. Because that's not, that's not really funny. So some people, some people would, would laugh, and I know some people that do that would laugh. Like, hey, look at that girl! Look at how she's walking. She's walking like she's freaking retarded. I mean, seriously, that's that's just terrible. But yeah, that's just I guess that's just how some people are. I don't know. <sighs> what a world we live in. So many fucking assholes all over the damn place. Like what? At least not everybody's bad. I mean, you guys are great. I mean, I could just say anything, and you guys would listen. That just, that just makes that's just a great feeling to have. Like to have somebody to talk to when you're just feeling like just really, really out of it. Like you freaking did nothing in your life, or when like you just upset. I mean, you guys. Sorry about that. You guys just make me feel so much better. Like, I know I don't make that much from YouTube. I made forty cents this month. But you want? I don't do. I don't care about the money. I don't care about the money. I'll get a job, like an actual job. Oh yeah, and um, by the way, I just wanna, I, I don't, I'm sorry I didn't say this before, but I wanna thank you guys very, very kindly for 150 subscribers. A, a channel, my ch our channel is growing really, really fast, and it's all because of you guys. I thank, for that, I thank you very much, and I love you, and I hope you guys keep enjoying my videos for, for many days to come. For many years to come. Oh god. That. Wow. Oops. Okay. Well, I'm a terrible driver. That's what you learned today. And you also learned that some people in my fucking school and in my class are fucking assholes. You learned that there's a lot of assholes in this world. So. I just wanna let you guys know, just beware of all those bitches, like, all the bitches that were like, like, I don't know. It's like, just be careful who you hang out with, and always be yourself. Don't change so somebody could, like, stop thinking that you're weird. If you're weird, then you're weird. If you're weird, then you're weird. Don't, ch ch don't try to change. That's just stupid. Don't try to be someone who you're not. I mean, nobody's perfect. I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect. But you know what? We can't get better. Nobody can get better. Because that's the way they are. That's the best as that, that they're going to be. And you guys are just amazing. Like, I'm not changing. You guys should not change your life. Your lifestyle because of what some retard on the street says. Okay, just be yourself. Don't be like... Don't be that guy that's like following other people. Like, oh, why are you wearing? Like, say if somebody makes fun of your clothes, you're like, why are you wearing pink? I mean, seriously, are you gay or something? If somebody says that to you, just ignore them and wear that pink shirt every single day, every single week, every single day. Wear something pink every single day. Be like, I like pink. I'm a guy. I like pink. You want? I'm a guy and I like pink too. I like really, really dark pink. That's a, it's a pretty nice color. Actually, I have a dark pink shirt. It's pretty nice too. And it's an anti-bullying science challenge shirt. 
Never thought you would hear, hear that. Anti-bullying and science challenge together. But yeah, I wonder if I can stop with the handbrake. Oh yeah, and never ever try to stop a, your car with the handbrake, because that won't really work. Handbrake is not meant for stopping cars. It's for... Yeah, it's a parking brake. So that was the handbrake, and... To compare it, that regular, that handbrake to this. Yeah, breaking with ABS. Let's just rev this thing a little bit. You know, there's... There's a car that looks exactly like this. It's like a Ford Fusion, I think. Like, take, take a look at a Ford Fusion. Ford Fusion, it looks pretty much just like this. Bug keeps going by my phone and I'm pissed at it. I hate you, Bug. Go die and... Yeah, go die. Just die. Alright, anyway. I'm gonna end this video here. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this. Little video of me, like, ranting on about my life. And yeah, if you guys go through that, that kind of trouble, just be yourself. Don't be, like... Don't go... Kill it. Don't go kill yourself, hanging yourself or something. Just be yourself. Don't change yourself because other people are like, oh, you're so weird and annoying. Don't change yourself. You want, if you're annoying, people say that you're annoying, be even more annoying. Prove your point. <coughs> anyway, thank, thank you guys for all the support. And thanks for 50 subscribers. And also, thank you for watching. I'm going to see if I can live stream. Probably not going to work, but anyway, yeah, peace out.